What's up everybody, Typical Gamer here with some more Hitman 2. This is a game that kind of I feel like a lot of people slept on uh, and not many people heard about because they heard about the first Hitman. I mean there's been a lot of Hitmans, but the first Hitman in this sort of new branch of series and it was kind of episodic, really really cool and this one came out and I haven't heard too much buzz about it. So we're playing it, uh, we're going to be on episode 3 now, so the third mission, third or fourth mission, I think it's the third mission, and uh, we're going to be trying to do it as creative as we can, taking out the targets and all that jazz so if you watch and enjoy this and you want to see more of the episodes as well hit that like button and again if you do want to see more episodes hit that subscribe button as well turn on those post notifications by smacking that bell and if you want to cop some fire merch head over to typical.store link in the description below so we're going to go ahead and go to the campaign mode we're going to go to the hitman 2 story and head over to we are now on chasing a ghost we're going to get our little mission to brief now and see what we have to do who we have to take out and sort of all the details surrounding that. Good evening, 47. The militia has released a hostage tape, outing the existence of Providence to the world. This was a fatal mistake, and our analysts are tracing its origin as we speak. In the meantime, we have a lead on Lucas Gray's top lieutenant. Turns out the Delgado cartel's counterfeiting unit was creating fake IDs for the militia. And hmm. one operative in particular stands out, Wazir Kale, an infamous South China Sea pirate better known by his nom de guerre, the Maelstrom. The Maelstrom and his cutthroat band of outlaws were the scourge of the shipping industry in the post-recession years. But his reign of terror came to an end with the disastrous 2014 hijacking of the supertanker, Francis King. Chinese elite forces stormed the ship, resulting in the deaths of a dozen sailors and most of the Maelstrom's crew. But Kale slipped away unseen. The Maelstrom's hmm. connection to Grey is unknown. But we believe it was he who carried out the audacious killing of a Providence CEO in Shanghai, along with two reactivated members of his old pirate gang, Vanya Shaw, a shady figure in Mumbai's criminal underworld, and Darwood Rangan, the gang's old cashier turned dodgy movie producer. Shaw, Rangan, and the Maelstrom form Lucas Gray's Eastern Cell. They are okay. a strike team, and stopping them is our client's most pressing concern. Unfortunately, the elusive Maelstrom appears to have vanished into the seedy underbelly of Mumbai, the cradle of his criminal legend, and no one knows his whereabouts or what he currently looks like. So, a bandit queen, a showbiz charlatan, and one certifiable ghost. I shall leave you to prepare. Yeah, let me find the guy who nobody knows who it looks like. So we gotta find those two, the lady and the guy, and then we gotta find out the mystery man we got to find out who he is and we got to take him out so looking through here find the maelstrom and verify his identity then we got to take out dawood rangan and vanya shah i think that's how you pronounce it there's a bunch of mission stories that kind of help you out in um deciding how you're going to take out these characters are kind of like a guided way of taking them out which uh sometimes are really helpful sometimes they're a little bit uh broad so you got to figure out some things on your own we're going to be concealing a silenced pistol i guess we'll wear we always wear his suit like these two are always not mission unique so signature uh 47 suit which is of course the black suit with the red tie you know it you love it that's always going to be there uh the queen suit is always there as well for some reason maybe it's because i got the special edition of the game i think that's probably the reason and then the imperial classic the one in the middle is typically the one that's unique to the mission so we're going to go ahead and rock that one again we're going to be smuggling the ica 19 but you could really choose any pistol that you please um no smuggled item starting location main street fiber wire for the gear you know a signature fiber wire take people out silently and then we got the coin as well we're going to be playing it on professional Let's go ahead and hop into it. I'm excited. Hopefully there's going to be... I mean, there's always so many ways to take people out that you could play these missions a couple of times and uh, really delve into each of those. But for the purpose of this walkthrough and for the purpose of not boring anybody so you don't have to see the whole mission over again, Welcome I'm only going to do it once through. One of the most densely populated cities in the world. Home to more than 12 million people. Jeez! I didn't know if that. If you wanted to disappear and hide from the world... This vast city is perfect. The maze-like sprawling slums offer secret paths and surprises around every corner. The elusive Maelstrom knows the city like the back of his own hand. Locating him will be a considerable challenge. 
A place to start could be the slums where his former gang, the Crows, has recently risen from the ashes. Darwood Rangan will be easy to find in his half-finished tower, wrapping up his new film called Mumbai Hero. <laughs> While Vanya Shah has ensconced herself in the overgrown remains of an old train yard. Your Great. three targets call this labyrinthine part of the city home, so choose your approach carefully. Great. All right. This is why they hire us. We're the hitman, and we gotta take these people out. So let's walk through here. There looks to be a bit of a traffic accident in here. How did you crash here, sir? Wow. Okay. They're trying to figure out what's going on there. Wow. All right. This is this is a huge map. We're looking around. We can see one of the targets there. There's a lot of things going on here. How do cars even drive through here? It's like no space. I could use a taxi. You want to bring me somewhere? All right. On the streets of Mumbai. We're discovering Mumbai. Oh, they got some uh, some drinks over here. They got some food. Very cool stuff. Very cool stuff. Now, there's a lot of stuff on the map right now. Bro, I'll take a taxi. Like, I'm down. Is this the building? Oh, this is the building. How on earth are we supposed to get up there? There's a car battery there. No entry. He's probably going to tell me you need to be... What's up? Hi. Can we get in? Mm, I don't think we can get in through here. Can lock if we had like a lock pick or something. Hmm. 47. Our intel suggests the Maelstrom is hiding somewhere in the city slums. I've marked the headquarters of the Crows on your map. Oh, perfect. Thank you. So infiltrate the crows hideout. So we could probably head over there first. I wish you could see like a general view of the map. Oh, there we go. So we are, where are we right now? So move map. We are over here. So find the maelstrom. This is all the crows hiding area. The map's actually pretty fairly big. So let's go ahead over here. We'll head over here and check it out. There's seven different levels. I'm assuming that's supposed to be because of the huge hotel. So let's go ahead and see this section over here. So sometimes when you listen in on conversations, you might get some intel, which really, really helps. Oh, that guy's going to think it's suspicious. All right, let's, let's walk in here. We do got to be careful here because... If we get spotted, we are screwed. Can we walk in through here? Oh. We need a key. Or a crowbar. Or a lockpick. Any of those really work. Alright, my best bet here, I think, is going to be to... Whoa, let's see over here. What is this? There's a bunch of boats here. There's a baseball bat. They're just throwing rocks over here. What is this? It's a cricket ball. You think we can assassinate somebody with a cricket ball? 47. The street gang known as the Crows are on high alert. They seem to be on the lookout for potential assassins and will be suspicious of anyone they don't recognize. I suggest you are mindful around them in the slums. Fair enough, fair enough. How can I... Hmm... There's a way to like move that. Okay, so my oh, hold up. Is that guy part of the crows? Oh no, that guy's just a chef. He's just a chef over here. See, if I want to take one out, I'm pretty sure I could just use this generator, take one out, and hide the rest of the bodies in there too, but I'm trying to look in here. It's gonna be a bit difficult. Seeing their rotation. There we go. Okay, that guy's out. I'm going to go ahead and turn the generator off. Okay, so the generator is now off. So he should be searching. 
and go out and fix the generator. There we go. Up and running. Let's close this. Okay, so that guy got taken out. So let's disguise as him. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Did he have a key on him? Please tell me he had a key on him. Oh, there we go. Okay, he had a key. House key. There we go. Oh no, he's a witness. Snap his neck. Let's go ahead and drag this guy in. Alright, let's look around. What is there here? There's some... Um, expired can of spaghetti sauce. Nothing too crazy here. So we gotta search the hideout. So they're all on the highest floor. Ooh! You could pick up an iron! Imagine taking somebody out with an iron. Oh shoot. Okay. So, you understand how the signal works? All I know is what you told me. Powder from the hideout goes in the kiln inside the metal shop. Colored smoke goes up. That's it. All right. Easy enough. And he'll let us know when we need to use it. Sounds good to me. All right then. Yeah. Just standing on guard here. Oh. I would probably just push him off, right? Oh gosh. All right. So not too much intel here. Let's climb up here. Is there anything up here? It's a nice little lookout tower here, huh? You get a view of everything. Let's climb back down, though. Oh, did he go? Whoa, whoa where did the guy go? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, he's over there. You think I could just push them both off and kill them both? That'd be a bit too much, right? What is this over here? Bear axe. Uh must be the new guy. Yeah, it must be, huh? I could silent attack him. Alright, let's go downstairs. I'm gonna carry this little bear axe. I don't think they're gonna be going out through here, so I don't think we have too much to worry about. We'll carry this bear axe just in case though. This guy knocked out here, and I think I should be good here, just to leave. Let's make sure to close those gates behind us. Actually, we probably should have go up through that top part. That top part was probably the way in. Let's go up through there. I'd push him, but definitely not the, the way of doing it, I feel. How about this? Can you tamper with this? Oh, brake mounting, missing crowbar. Oh, can I push him off? No, I feel like I'm going to attract too much attention to myself if I do that. Going through here, though. It's another section of the crow's nest. Oh, shoot. Oh, he's going to go investigate. I should have thought. Why, why didn't I think that was going to make noise? How do I put this thing away? Oh shoot. Nothing to worry about. Yeah, I think that's a bad idea to go through there. This guy's looking over this way or else I would go in. Oh, I might be able to go through. The problem is that those little curtains make noise. If they didn't make noise, we could potentially just sneak by there, but... Okay, I can take out this guy. I just gotta make sure to know when he rotates. This guy could sneak by fairly easily. 
This is the guy I want to take out, though, especially when he moves. I need to get a little bit closer. Oh, he's going to see me. Oh, there we go. We're good. All right, so we already have his outfit, so that's not going to do us any good. But we just needed to get by him, so let's try to drag him. Oh, no. Oh, no, don't fall off. Oh, gosh. I'm going to botch the whole operation. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is a public area. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, this is all going horribly wrong. Is there anywhere to hide a body here? There's a gun down there. Um, shoot. Okay, I think this just leads out. Yeah, this just leads out. Oh, there's some intel there. Just following orders. Boss told us to evacuate everyone and stick around until after the meeting. That's what we are doing. So you have talked to him. Nobody talks to the boss. He left a message. You just left the message, huh? Give the signal. Boss, he's still up to his old tricks. So, armed thugs belonging to the street gang known as the Crows have evacuated a hill in the slums of Mumbai. This could be worth investigating. Hmm, yes, quite, quite. Let's go ahead and follow this one. Search the house for clues. Shoot. Fine. Just tell the guys upstairs when. They'll raise the flag and summon him. Okay. Seems like a good plan to me. Oh, shoot. He's going to be right there. How am I supposed to... I'm kind of stuck here now. How about if I throw a coin over there? Do you guys think that would work? If I throw a coin around the corner, is there anybody else here? I don't think there's anybody else here. Okay, that I definitely got that guy's attention. Yeah, go check it, dude. Go check. Oh yeah. Oh, you smart. You gonna get a promotion? Just did. Elite thug. Okay, we gotta bring this guy's body quick over to the other body. As much as I want to conceal them in the bushes. <gasps> oh, I can put him in there. I didn't know that. Dope. Oh, look at us now. We're an elite thug now. Alright, so what did he have? He had a little Uzi. He had a little Uzi vert. Oh, my coin. Thank you. My little Uzi vert. We're a gangster now. Let's make sure we get the other body up there, though. We want to make sure that we leave no evidence behind. Just the one guy who wakes up and probably won't want to talk about his experience because then he'll be killed. So let's drag him on through here. Get your coin, too. Yes. If you leave stuff on the ground, too... Sometimes it can give you away, so that's why you don't want to do it. I know I left the gun down there, but it kind of fell down a little bit, so I'm not too concerned about that. I'll put the Uzi away for now. Hello, yes. Does she have a place I could... I need to stuff her into somewhere, too. Hello. Good day to you, too. Almost too good of a day. Is she pregnant? I need to verify she's not pregnant. Doesn't look pregnant to me. Choke her out. <laughs> and let's stuff her in the closet. There you go. See, I'm a considerate hitman. I'm a very considerate hitman. Ooh, a coin. Oh. Ooh, a glass of wine. Oh. Oh. Oh, what the heck? 
Oh, this is probably you could get him to have dinner here with that chick because he he's in love with her, and then you could poison it. What is this? Oh, let's take the rat poison just in case. We gotta search the house for clues. <gasps> There's a note. Hmm. A letter signed Wazir. This house once belonged to the Maelstrom Forty Seven. This confirms a connection between him and the woman living here now. I know we're supposed to raise the flag when this Neha lady tells us, but how is he going to see it from the slums? I don't know. He's the Maelstrom. He's got eyes everywhere, you know. <sighs> Sometimes I think he's just a myth. A legend we tell ourselves to have something to look up to. I mean, have you ever seen him? No. I gotta stuff one of these guys into a box. In case he did show up. But it would be quite the story to tell the others, right? Yeah. Sure would be. Yeah. Sure would be, guys. Can I raise the flag? Will you guys... He told me to raise it. You guys are really bad guards, by the way. Oh, I'm just gonna... Hi. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and raise the flag. There you go. You wanna go? Is that it? No, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, what's this? A brick. Oh, we can straight up knock one out. So, wait to see who shows up to the meeting. Okay. I guess we'll wait up. We can wait right here, though, right? Oh. Oh, never mind. I mean, we could wait right here. We've choked a few people out, so we just gotta be careful. Like, our, our disguise isn't given away yet. 47? Someone's coming up the stairs leading to the secured area. It looks like a man. See if you can get close to him. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. This is the guy for sure. Are you him? This guy's the maelstrom without a doubt. Oh. Wait, what do you mean just inside there? How am I supposed to get there? What is he getting? He's putting on a different outfit. Oh, he changed clothes. You sneaky snake. He's got a gold earring. That's definitely him. Okay, I can't take him out until I know for sure it's him. There was supposed to be a guard here. Oh, no. That's the maelstrom. You found him. All right. It's me. <laughs> oh, choke him out. Oh, go to sleep. Go to the sleep. The infamous Maelstrom is dead. Very well done. <laughs> Got him. No rest for the wicked, however. On to the next one. Oh, she gonna wake up. Oh, you gonna meet up with her. Don't worry about it. There you go, buddy. <sighs> Oh, it's going to be very traumatic. There's going to be a lot of therapy there. There's going to be a lot of therapy there. Okay. Let's get on out of here. I am the silent assassin, ladies and gentlemen. Where was the outfit that I originally changed to? Oh, it was way over there. Okay, okay. So we got to eliminate Vanya and Dawood. Ah, wood. Let's go ahead and get our clothing back. Oh, pardon me. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is another room. Oh, I'm so dumb. I thought that was a window. Please excuse me, chat. Uh, I think I changed outside, so. Let me grab this gun too. 
Oh shoot. I'm gonna drop it in here. Oh shoot, I'm trespassing. Of course I am. Uh, let me drop this. There we go. Alright, perfect. Alright! And ain't nobody the wiser. Ain't nobody the wiser. Alright, so we got two more targets to go. We got Vanya Shah and Dawood Rangan. So I think that we can open up here and go to mission stories. And then we could kind of choose based on here. So Gone with the Wind. I kind of want to see this one because I feel like it would be hilarious. Uh, we have to get up there. Do you think they'd let a cook into the building? Wait a second. Cook, sir. No, cook, sir. Oh. This is probably the way I got to go, isn't it? I'm trespassing now. This is definitely the way we got to go. I got to get one of their outfits or else this isn't going to work. Can I go through the tube? Ooh. You know, the movie's based on real events. It's about a pirate saving the city of Mumbai from some sort of witch. How is that based on anything real? Nangan told me the other night. He used to run with that pirate guy, the Maelstrom. He wrote down a lot of things. He did. I should tell him, be like, he did. So this Maelstrom character is the guy who is supposed to save the city. Who is this witch then? Beats me. And to be honest, I think Rangan himself thinks he is the hero. <laughs> Hence the kissing scene. Okay. Talk about being delusional. Talk about being delusional. Alright, so... Y'all just gonna hang out and, like, hug each other? Or are y'all gonna move? Because... How am I gonna get by these two? Oh, a crowbar. Oh, lead pipe. You could think I could whip it at one's head and knock him out? Oh, I definitely could, right? I think a lead pipe might be a bit brutal, though. Maybe I could slip on by a little bit more. Okay, man. The coin distraction? Hold up. You might be you might be on something here. No, I think I'm good just slipping on by right here. I don't think we gotta do Oh, there's a lot of them, huh? Shoot. Uh oh that guy back there he's by himself Oh shoot I'm stuck between like three of them right now Okay those guys won't come look at me This guy's gonna rotate is he gonna talk to him? Oh shoot Where are those guys going? Where are you going? All right, I got an idea. As soon as that guy comes out, I'll throw a coin over here. He'll investigate around the corner. I'll choke him out. Yeah. Go check it out, dude. It's a creepy ghost. There we go. Okay, I gotta put this guy somewhere. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, that guy recognizes his homie. 
He's like, where did he go? He must have went to the bathroom or something. Honestly, it might just be good to leave him here. We'll bring him like right here. I have a feeling he's gonna discover the body. I don't know why. No, I don't think he will if I leave him there. All right, perfect. We're free to roam a little bit. What's up, dude? Yeah. What is this? Oh, it's a hammer. What's up, dude? Aren't we cool? Yeah, we're cool. I'm gonna go in here. Ooh. Control crane. Um, no way. I could drop this on people. This is awesome. Take out both those guards. How far can the crane go, though? Oh, it can go over there. Interesting. Fire extinguisher. I'm just checking out, making sure everything's secure there, sir. How about if I go up here? What's up here? Just use a hammer and whip it at everybody, right? Oh, shoot. It's a little high up here. Just one scene to go and we're done. Looks like the fan has been set up again. Do you know why they haven't shot it yet? Karishma threw the last copy of the script into the elevator shaft. She doesn't want to do the scene with Rangan. He still wants to do the kiss. Oh, are the nerve of this guy? Chutia. He's a creep. And Karishma isn't having it. I think she's crazy to pull something like that. So what is this? The production this? of Mumbai Hero is coming to a close, but it seems there's a spot of trouble. Lead actress Charisma Hassan has refused to do a kissing scene with Rangan Ooh. and has got rid of the script by tossing it down an elevator shaft. Shame. The scene features the use of a large industrial wind machine. Okay. I see where this is going. Seems to be working. Let's hope nobody finds the script then. Rangan doesn't deserve to get his way. Disguise yourself as Bollywood crew. Like, is there any way for me to get up there? Eh. Oh, gosh, it hurts. It hurts. The oh, no, lady. Lady, I really don't want to hurt you. How do I fall down? I'll drop down. There we go. All right. Slide into the DMs like, woo. Right. That's a hammer. We gotta disguise yourself as Bollywood crew. Can I take out that security camera? Or will that... Okay, I want to save. I'm gonna save into an empty slot here. If I take out the security camera, will that do anything? Oh. It's apparently what I should have been doing. Oh, he's still local security. Good night. He doesn't really change anything, his outfit. I'm drinking coffee. I'm not drinking kombucha this time, chat. We go, let's put him in there and then we got to pick up his gun too let's go ahead and do that and holster that no holster it we, oh shoot what's he investigating i didn't do anything involving him Ooh. Uh, we we might need an accident on the shoot. I'm sorry.
All right, we got a lot of things to do here. What is this? Is that a hammer as well? Bro, people just leaving hammers everywhere. Y'all you, you got to be careful. All right, so that's the security room. That's the producer there. Ooh, rat poison. Ooh, industrial fan instructions. Darwood Rangan has leased an industrial strength fan, normally used for clearing smoke from construction tunnels. That's a beast of a machine, 47. The crew have put some sort of limiter on the fan output, but maybe you could make a few changes. Yes, come into the room. Hmm. Put away the rat poison for now. Let's see where he goes. So, oh, there's three people there. Are you serious? This is like the best thing ever. It seems the alarm comes in. If this was a restaurant, it would have been shut down by the food people. You know what I heard? That, that looks like some good food, I'll be honest. Every night the ship books with the leftovers and bingo. Oh, he's booking it. Okay, wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. Before you book it anywhere. What? Yeah, what? Go check it out, dude. Okay, I understand. Yeah, right behind there. Good night. <laughs> He's going. All right. Let's, uh, disguise as him. Find the missing script. Let's drag him and put him in here, though, real quick. Yoink! I'm part of the crew now, son! I told you, Mama, I'd make it! She would still know who it is, because... I mean... You gotta know your own crew, right? She's facing the other way. Yeet! Oh, shoot! Dip, 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 dip. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's right over there. How do I get there? How do I get there? Wait, is there an elevator up there? I see the missing script. Anybody know how to get it? There's no actual elevator. I don't have a lasso. I, I literally see it. Oh, do I pick up a hammer and throw it at it? Oh! No way that worked. No. <laughs> that actually worked. Okay, I need to go down now, though. Oh, this is getting dangerous now. When are you going to be oh. in those colors? I mean, how long could it take to smudge out a few blues and reds? I'm creating art here. Seventy percent of the work is finding the right colors. Color mixing is He made a freaking What's the guys from the Oompa Loompas? Yeah, He's well, blue. Alright, I just need to climb through this window. Y'all making this real difficult. The fashion, fashion, fashion. Oh, that's a washroom. Right, did I knock it down here? Or is it one more floor down? Oh gosh, it's right down there! Oh shoot! 
Move it, lady! Oh, shoot! Amazing how Rangan managed to put together another epic, huh? I can't wait to see the results. It's a lot lighter than the first one. Oh, yes. I got the missing script. Give the script to the director. Okay. Let's pick up the hammer. Let's put the hammer away. Let's hang. Oh, shoot. Let's hang. All right, where's the director at? We got to give him this script. Shoot. I should have went up the other way. What is that? Chill! Okay, where does this go? Oh, I'm up here now. Oh, dope. I know where I am. All right, let's close that. Let's get up there. You mean a smurf? Oompa Loompa, psh. Ciao, good. It's good to see you in chat, dude. I probably meant a smurf. But Oompa Loompas kind of looks like him, right? Oompa Loompa Doompa Dee Doo. All right. Who recognizes me here? Oh, look at that. That's a beautiful movie set. Look at that. All right. Ooh. All right, director. Director, here you go. I found this. The script? You found it. Um, Thank you. Awesome. You don't find this problem. awkward? Listen, because I find it very running. awkward. Run over and manage, will you? Right before the scene starts, I'll signal to you to turn it on. E Just make sure the safety is on and you don't go above the Safety's indicator. on. Don't go above the indicator go. power. Good work, 47. Darwood is hurrying down now to act Shh. out the final scene with Hassan. Let's make sure he doesn't run out of wind. Get to your places. We are ready to shoot. All right, everybody. Mr. Rungan is on his way. We just need to get this one scene in the can, and then that is a wrap. Grishma. Uh. Get the missing. I'm yours forever, and I'll give me hero. Oh, we have a couple options here. So, um, what's my motivation? Like, why kiss him? He is a foul fighter. There we go. We're making sure everything's okay. Are ready for the final, most important shot of the film. Yes. Ma, are you ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Okay, step on up. Yes. Okay, let's get this show on the road. Start the fan. Do you always start it right now? All right, I'll start it right now. Oh, look at this! Oh, look at that! This is awesome! Increase the fan power. Oh! Darwood Rangan is confirmed killed. Just one target left. No! Got blown off the side of the building by a piece of malfunctioning oh, no. equipment. <laughs> uh, no, we didn't get the final shot, but we did get the accident on camera. And well, to be honest, I think it looks pretty good. Oh my goodness! Yes, I think uh, we can. In fact, I think it would be an even better ending. And I think, uh, I mean, think of the PR. This would be my ticket to the big leagues. Goodness uh, gracious, lady. Our ticket. So, are uh, we okay to go ahead? I'll start the edit straight away. Great, yeah, fantastic. Will you call the insurance company? 
Okay, perfect. Yeah, yeah. This lady's a savage! Yeah, you're welcome! Can you give me some cash for that? I blew him straight off the roof. Wonder if it'll show me on the screen. Oh, it does look! Hello. I am in this movie now. It is I, Agent 47. And I've come with a message. Don't be blown up. Or blown off. Alright, let's move. That guy looks distraught. Poison water bottle. Alright, let's get out of here. You know, I wish there was a way to not take out the chicken. There probably was. I just can't figure it out. I probably just had to wait a little bit. Alright, last target. Vanya Shah. We gotta take her out very creatively. In a very creative manner. Let's go out the way we came. We should be good. No witnesses. Look at these guys, they're still talking about the future. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Where did we change our clothes? I want to look like my guy again. Actually, no, wait. That might not be a good idea. Alright, you know what? It's worth it. Although I'm trespassing. And that's illegal. I got swag points now. Swag points! And I gotta look good. We out! There we go. Alright, last target. How are we gonna take her out? We got a couple different mission stories. So, uh, a close shave. Oh no, this, this one isn't available. Uh, we can do a dress to die for. A matter of discipline. Hmm... What should we do? I think that we should go... Should we do a dress to die for or a matter of discipline? Let me know your thoughts. It's either or, really. We gotta choose one of them. Look at our intel, too. We got some... Um, what did we get? We got a tube of paint. Oh, powerful fan. We got luxury apartment key card. I think that was actually just for... That apartment in there. Wherever we just were. Where were we? Oh. Yeah, it kind of looks like that, right? I'm not sure. Alright, let's push on through. We got to get over to our girl. Oh, gosh. This is a hole. Alright, everybody's saying a dress to die for. So let's go ahead and activate that one. Here we go. And let's get over to that mission. Everything's gone over pretty smoothly. I mean, this is... If you're an assassin like Hitman, like Agent 47, then I, I feel like this is a good day of work for you. Let's get over there. This area is super cool. Has anyone seen Bavin Sagar? I have a job interview today and I desperately... Oh, shoot. Why is there a guard right there? Why would I be suspicious? I'm not even doing anything. Let's go around. It's suspicious that he thinks I'm suspicious. You know what I mean? And I don't appreciate that. Oh, wow. They have, like, a militia here. Coach Milaka, did you have any luck? No. That tailor is impossible. I explained to his employee that Miss Shah wants to meet with him, but he claimed that the tailor wasn't available. So you didn't just go inside and look? Only the Royal Guard can do stuff like that. I'm sure Miss Shah will send someone with more hands-on experience than me. <laughs> He's the only terror in town that can make that damn dress. That's what happens when you drown all the others, I guess. It appears Vanya Shah is in the market <coughs> for a dress fit for a queen. She's sent after a local tailor, but for some reason the man refuses to cooperate. 
A man of your impeccable taste should be able to fill in perfectly for the tailor. Yes, quite. <laughs> yes. All right, disguise yourself as disguise yourself as the tailor. Oh, there's two guys in there. There's three people. How am I? Okay, there's a lot of people in there. What can I do this time here? Sign here. I could use the. Oh no, screwdriver won't work to open this actually. Okay, let's see what we got here. Uh, the only thing I see that we can use. Maybe if we climb on the roof. Oh no, this is. I think we're not allowed back here, right? No Can way. I, You're not oh, allowed to. Okay, I'm sorry. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Um. Think you're coming on a bit strong there. Bro, I'm not even. Don't feel the same way. Okay, that's cool. Back off. I just want the Go India sign. Oh my gosh, lady. It's not all about you. Goodness. Some people. Some Another people, chat. Just came by to try to convince Uncle Vihan to come over to the train yard. He didn't say yes, did he? I know it's a great honor to be able to make a dress for the slum queen. But what happened to the other tailors? No. Uncle is planning on going into hiding, I think. Oh. I heard they fished out one of the other tailors from the harbor yesterday. Drowned. She's a witch, that Vanya Shah. Goodness. Not evil. All right, they gave me some more intel. This is good. Stop blending in for a second. So he is down there. If there was a way for me to get onto that roof, that would be very, very handy. And I think there is. But I think it also involves getting past this guy. Which who is making my life a bit harder. Not gonna lie. The, the roof is the only way to get up though. Maybe if I go all the way around. Let's try that. I don't know. I need the money, but So this is the train yard here. We could probably just go in and try to take her out. I feel like that would be a little risky though. Can you hide in here? The Steeler House. Stop being so dramatic. Know your mother. Oh. Acha. If you have Ma over for some chai, tell her I said hi. Oh, he rhymed it too. You can't access the hill. Meeting will be over soon. Then you can return to your home. Chal, nikal. You make me sick. You make us sick. Kicking us out of our home. What are we going to do about it? And I'm not comfortable with it. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I thought I was protesting with you, but apparently not. Okay, that dude's straight up guarding the freaking stairs. Alright, I think we're getting close to where we originally started, right? I think. So we should be able to find a couple of knock... Oh. Alright, we need to get our outfit back. Okay, this is definitely where I knock some people out. We need to get our OG outfit on. So let's enter through here. Elite thug. There we go. Who's going to stop me now, huh? Who's going to stop me now? Ain't nobody going to stop me now. Let's go up through here. Are these guys still chilling? You guys are doing such a great job. You guys are doing so good. All right. There we go. Let's push all the way through here. All right, perfect. Now we're making some progress. Oh, shoot. Of course, that guy's the only guy that recognizes me. Look at the size of this dude's shotgun. Hey, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Can 
Can I unlock this with the key? I'm missing the key. Okay. Right, I think I gotta go through this side. This is the guy I was trying to get past. Jerk! Alright, here we go. Woof! So, he's just hiding in there now? Yeah. Shah sent someone over to talk to him, but he refused to come down. Oh, shoot. Oh gosh. Oh, there's some papers here. Request of the tailor. Some coins. Measuring tape. Yo, can I choke somebody out with measuring tape? That'd be pretty dope. There's one bin here. How many people are downstairs? One, two. Are you, there's three people down. What are you all doing downstairs for? Oh no, he's leaving! Gosh darn it! Hee hee hee. Power off. Alright, they're searching. I should be able to take them out one by one. If I do this properly. I gotta make sure. I got measuring tape in my hand, though, so I don't want to assassinate anybody by accident. I'd rather have coins in my hand. I'm fixing a fuse box in case anyone was wondering. You're not. You're doing nothing of the sort. You're going in the box. Get the frickin' box! Fixing. Fixing. Now why the hell am I talking to myself? I don't know, but you're going down, son. You're going in the box, too. There you go. Power's back on. Nobody's the wiser. Alright, now this guy is just gone for a little adventure. So I didn't think I have to take out everybody in his house, apparently. But I did what I did, okay? So no regrets about that. We gotta go find this tailor. This tailor has, has left his home. Not knowing that I took out a bunch of people just to get to him. It's okay, though. It's okay. I'm not offended. He doesn't know me. I don't know him. I'm not here to kill him. Have a great day. Oh, there he is. Listen, I'm telling you the truth. Maelstrom left Mumbai because he was recruited by the British to work. All right. So we just got to make sure that we take him out at a good section. <sighs> None of these areas look really good, though. I mean, I can take him out here, but... Like, there's two guys there, there's that person there, there's that person crouched over there. Oh, this might be good. Oh, shoot. Um. Don't go on the boat. Don't go on the boat. I heard that. Who's tossing shit? Ah, nice! Excellent. Let's find out what kind of dress a woman like Vanya Shah wants. Right. 
Shah wants a cerulean dress, 47. Perhaps you will be able to source a roll of the right fabric at the local cloth market. I could dump and eliminate him. I don't know, chat. What do I do? It's kind of risky, because, like, leaving him there, it seems like people could walk by there. Yo, you think I can knock out this guy with a fish? Hear that? That's your frying in oil, baby. I want to knock... Hold up. I want to knock him out with a fish, but, like, I want to make sure I do it right, you know? So I'm going to save here. And then we're going to hit him with a nice little wallop. Oh, oh shoot. I killed him. <laughs> no regrets. No regrets. Okay, we got to dump him, I feel. I'm sorry, dude. No, oh, go. Oh! Goodness gracious. All right, let's get out of here. We had to do what we had to do, chat. We're a hitman, not a not a unicorn. Okay? You remember that. I look like a tailor. I look like a beautiful tailor now. Use a bush. All right, so find an appropriate cloth sample. All right, that shouldn't be too hard. Excuse me, I need a cloth sample. Greetings, sir. Can I interest you in my fine wares? Cheap, durable cloth in many special colors. How much of these? Ah, my friend, you have chosen well. Now, we have the best prices here. What do you say to 140 rupees per running meter? Does that sound fair? <laughs> no? Nothing? Ah, I can see you're a man of refined taste and a skilled hunter. My kids will only eat rice tonight, but it's yours for 105 rupees. Then. It's a deal, yes? Nope. Wow, those eyes are really burning into me. Four so coins now. It was five coins to start. Just looking straight into my soul. Okay, final offer now. 90 rupees. Make it three coins and it's a deal. Rupees per running meter. That's my three coins. I, I really can't go low. <laughs> <laughs> These still no. Your haggling skills are something else. Oh, I haven't even have said a word. The silence. It's, it's terribly unnerving, to be honest. It's like you're uh, just dead inside. <laughs> like this vast, empty space where your emotions would normally reside. He's really digging into me here. No lower than seventy-five rupees. Really, take the offer. Please take the offer. Two coins. He's crying now. My grandmother made these with her own hands. There's blood on the loom every night because she works so hard. The fair Jeez. price is 100 rupees, so that's what I'm charging. That serves you right for just standing there like a corpse. Oh, really? Drop the price. Fine. The story about my grandmother is a lie. <laughs> silence is killing me. Just, just have it at what I buy it. 40 rupees, that's it. Please, it's a fair price. You beat me. Take it. 40 rupees, okay. One coin. Wait. All right. It's a deal. Ah, <laughs> good, good. Take any of the bundles, please. Just one. Though. Okay, let's get her a. Let's get her a. Great. This Thank one. You. Come again. All right. We got it for one coin. Chat, one coin. Wait, that wasn't an appropriate cloth sample? Hey! How much of these? Ah, you're back. Ah, my friend, you have chosen well. No! Now, we have the best price. No! Here. What do you say to 140 rupees per You! Rupee? Does that sound fair? <laughs> no? Nothing? Ah, I can see you're a man of refined taste and a skilled hand. My kids will only eat. Which rice one's an appropriate cloth? It's a deal, yes. I'll do four coins. Okay, three coins and I'll do it. Has to be a certain kind. We're just gonna wait for the one coin, guys. What do you think? He's a really bad haggler. 
at my own cost. I got good haggling skills here. We're gonna read super chats in the meanwhile while this guy does his little speech thing. Chat to everybody in chat again. If you are watching and enjoying this, do be sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you're new. And if you want to uh, donate and pop up on screen, link will be in the description below. Shout out to Chowku with the six, just donating more than Waleed. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Shout out to you, Chowku. Appreciate you, man. Uh, Waleed with the five. Hey, TG, the Requiem suit is from a past game called Hitman Blood Money. The last scene is your death with you wearing it. You can come back to life if you want during the credits. Great story, too. TG Lee in Alberta. Waleed, are you a big fan of the Hitman series? Because you know so much about it, man. Big shout out to you and thank you for the little, uh, the lore. The lore involved. Get the blue one. Come on, give me it for one. One coin, please. And then shout out to, uh, Paul Askew. Appreciate that. Happy birthday, man. Hope you have a good one. Best birthday ever. Uh, chat with the 20. A few words today. I'm just glad to be here and join the stream. You stay you, bro. And always stay awesome. Bro, big shout out to you. It's good to see you. Let me know what's going on with you, man. Let me know if you're going to be streets more often. I miss ya. Appreciate ya. Paul Askew. Uh, good content makes you feel sneaky. Oh, shout out to you, man. It's a deal. There you go, one dollar. Take any of the bundles, please. Just one. Though. Shout out to you, Paul. Great. There we go. Come again. Now arrange an audience with Vanya Shah. So let's go ahead and do that. Short. The merchant does have short-term memory loss. Clearly. You. Did you bring the cloth for Miss Shah? Yes, I have it right here. About bloody time. Come with me. Oh, don't be alarmed, by the way. Miss Shah takes security very seriously, Amen. so the guards will search you. Not to worry. Uh, yeah, you gotta give me a second. Oh, wow, that's cool. Um, let's drop. We gotta drop, like, everything. Samir, are you good? We got. I don't think we gotta drop the fish. We can keep the fish. I don't think the fish is suspicious. The lead pipe is illegal. The Uzi is illegal. Everything else should be good. All right, frisk me. Hey there. I'm afraid your honest look isn't going to cut it here. All right, I'm frisk have me. To frisk you, pretty boy. Whoa, whoa, man. Just stand still, and it'll it's uncalled for. Soon. All right, it's a little bit too thorough, if you ask me. All right, man. Miss Shah has been dying to meet you. Oh. It's not wise to keep her waiting, you know. I won't disappoint yeah. her then. Hey. That is a good idea. She's not been happy with the other tailors. Oh, Either I've heard. Morning, just play along with her eccentricities. She can be rather dangerous. Thank you. I'll do my best. Good man. Do well and there'll be a lot of money in it for you. I know. I was recorded by security. Shoot. Here we are. Just go through there. The queen is waiting for you in the garden. Okay. Wait for your turn. This is exquisite. I feel perhaps that is not the wisest decision to make when in a financial situation. That is Vanya Shaw. Self-appointed queen of the of Mumbai slums. Wow. You with your income, provided the child lives so long. <laughs> that is the problem. Little Raji is not well. Five years, Mr. Hussain. Five, five years, my queen. Yes. Five additional years of servitude to your queen. For you and your wife. In exchange, I will take care of the bills for your new one until she is old enough to work the spinning mills. That is my offer, Mr. Hussein. Talk it over with your wife. I expect your acceptance tonight. Good day. Wow, she does not seem like a nice lady. Sorry to hear that, dude. Ah. I'll pay your kids' bills. Mr. Taylor, here at last. Let's have a look at the cloth you've chosen. I Present want to, to you. Sure the color is the right one. Yeah, yeah, it's... Yes, of course. Here it is. Uh... Oh, gosh, bro. Is this Saruline? Or is it Carmine? Which one is it? I gotta go back in the video here. I honestly don't recall which one it is.
Oh gosh, which one is it? I, I just watched it and I still don't understand which one it is. Give me a second here, chat. Oh shoot, I skipped it. Which one is it? I'm gonna die because of this. It's Sarah Lean. It's a lean one. All right, is that actually a, a color? Because I've never heard that color in my life, chat. We're, like, we're the big bird. I've never heard that. So it's Sarah Lean. Blue. Beautiful Excellent. blue. Find me some progress here. Come with me. I want you to take my measurements while you're here. Smart work, 47. Mm -hmm. Shaw will want to have privacy when measuring for the dress. I'll leave the final execution up to you. What the heck? Did... You good? Hello? Oh, she's got like a train car. What did she do to you? Gosh, she's like missing an eye? Please, we want privacy! You there. Leave us. I want some privacy. Let's start the measuring right away. If you didn't bring a date, then would you sit one of the other dates that there's behind? You can use that. What do you, what do you, wait, what, what, what do you, what do you mean they, they won't, they won't need it? Can you leave? Oh, gosh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You, tell your lady to leave! She's on her phone and stuff! Relax your back, please, Miss Shaw. Tell her to leave! I'll just measure your arms now, Miss Shar. Turn around, please, Miss Shar. I need to measure shoulder to shoulder. You've probably heard about the other dealers. How some of them ended up in the gutters because they didn't please me. This yeah. dress is important to me. Okay. Well, not the dress itself, but... What it represents. You see, there are those out there who do not want to pay tribute to their queen. People who think the value of their lives can be measured in money. It started with one man, but these things spread like ripples in the water. Soon another, then a third. Tributes to your queen keep you alive, not money. Eventually, I will find a craftsman who understands the true value of life. Is that man you? I wonder. That's all I need, Miss Shah. I'm done here. Excellent work. See yourself out. Your queen has other business to attend to. Are you kid? Are you freaking kidding me? Where did she go? Shoot. Wait, can I speak with you one more time, please? I need to take your measurements again. I need to take your measurements again. I... Hello? Hey! What the fuck are you doing here? I'm sorry. Ah! Okay, I gotta figure this out. Ooh, there's like chandeliers and stuff. Get out my face. What? Uh, but you guys are really rude. Oh, what is this? Yes. Hello. Huh? It's about the visa for the meditation part of Queen Charlotte. I know they said someone will fix it a few days. My queen. My queen. We're not done our measurements. Queen. 
Chick has a cell phone and everything, dog. Queen Shah spent a lot of time in there for her meditation. I don't want to risk it. I, I don't think that you could dress up as the girl. Interesting. Shaw's personal steam pond appears to be out of order. Maybe you should take a look at the rooftop water tanks, 47. Okay, okay. All right, let's do that one. Oh, that's just intel. Is there a mission story? Okay, is this one? I understand. No one will touch it until you come by tomorrow. Okay, thank you. The queen will really appreciate this. She's so close. We just got to kill her. Okay, maybe we should do the other storyline. Or we can go to the roof. Is this trespassing though? I'm just a lost little tailor. Oh shoot. Definitely is trespassing. Oh shoot. There's so many dudes up here. Oh shoot. Oh, they got AKs and stuff. Oh, I'm out. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Are you kidding me? Okay. Are you kidding? Yes, it was. Oh, nah. Hey, what the hell are you doing here? You stop. You fish, huh? Well, now you're coming with me. That's it. Who wants the fish? Yes. Where's the queen? I've come for the queen! Confirmed kill on Vanya Shaw. Excellent work, 47. I don't see him. Do you? Surprise, mother trucker! Oh gosh! It landed on my sirloin! I won't go down without a fight! Oh god! It hurts to live! Okay. Slow that up. <laughs> Whoops. All right. Um. Oh, maybe we can just go to this point here. Let's see if we just choke her out there. If that works out. Yeah. No, I am a silent assassin. That was just when I go wild. I go wild. You know. I need to. Well, what are you waiting for? Get on. Uh oh, measure this. Measure this, son. What do I got here? Do I got my fish? Don't kill on Vanya Shaw. Excellent work, 47. Mission completed. Time to find an exit. Everyone gets the fish! Yo, what is this thing? Oh. Everyone gets the frickin' stick, dude. If you... Does that show how many people you killed? Oh, uh, it does. Okay. So, should I... I don't want to kill her and end the mission here when, like... Like, I could do that, but... I don't know. What do you guys think? Please, Miss Shar. I need to... What's the hold up? Oh, there's a... What do you mean, what's the hold up? You've Turn been killed by a fish? Miss Shar. I need to measure shoulder to shoulder. Shoulder to shoulder, this. No. 
Oh gosh. Kill on Vanya Shaw. Excellent work, 47. Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the dun dun floor. Look at this. What the hell? Smoked her. Look at this. You ready? All right, last load. I need a sneeze. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's just take her out how we would with the measuring tape. Please, Miss Shaw. I need to. Okay, well, real quick, real quick, chat. So we have two options. One, I feel like this option would be a bit more authentic. We could do the a matter of discipline because in our first playthrough, without the save, we wouldn't be able to do this and assassinate her straight up like right here. So I think it's cheap if we just assassinate her here from a save like a load. So I think it's better if we go here and do this mission story. Does that make sense? Let me know what you think. So do you think we should take her out here or do the other mission? Let me know what you think. Take her out here or do the other mission. What is it? Do you guys see this little, this little shadow? How do I get rid of that shit? What is causing that shadow? Maybe if I turn up the brightness here, give me a sec. My shadow's gone now. Now I just look super white. Super white like a light. I just, I just don't want to feel like I've, I I gypped the mission, you know? A lot of people saying do the other mission. All right, let's do that one. Get on with it. Turn around, please, Miss Shar. I need to measure shoulder to shoulder. Or should I just take her out? You've probably heard about the other dealers. How some of them ended up. All right, a lot of people saying here. Yeah, it didn't please me. Shut up. Keep measuring tape. <laughs> All right. Um, and then. Confirmed kill on Vanya Shaw. Excellent work, forty-seven. Mission completed. Time to find an exit. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and pick up the train yard. I have like 50 train yard keys now. All right, let's leave. How on earth do I get out? Oh. An exit right there. Hello, how are you? Hey, how are you? We are escaping, chat. Nothing suspicious about me. Oh, shoot. I don't like my outfit, though. The body was... Body found. You know which body they found? The one from so long ago. I'm out of here. What the heck? Is there no way to me get out of here? Oh, crowbar. Just go ahead and pry this open. Well, I'll see y'all later. Peace. Oh, pay two coins to get out. Should I take the boat or the taxi? I feel like the boat would be a smoother ride out. We would take out the guy by the boat, too. Let us, let us get on the boat with this fish. As it flops around. Goodbye. 
Toodaloo, mother truckers! Beautiful. Absolute skill and finesse. A dress to die for. Look at that. Skills to pay the bills. Apparently, I don't think we technically completed the fan one because I don't think you were supposed to take out the chick with it. But, you know what? We did it our own way. We only get a one star. We've never got more than one star. I thought we did amazing. I thought we did amazing. I really did. But apparently not. There we go. So you can go detailed. I think, you know what it is? I feel like if you don't, um, let's go back here. Like if you, like you don't get max mission rating unless you, oh, we unlocked a bunch of stuff. Construction site, washing stalls, streets on the hill, blah, 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 blah. We got a, oh, we got a freaking shotgun to start off with. A remote explosive. Ooh. Start off at the barge, or at the boat, or the laundry. Look at those. Yeah, so then it gives you some some options to do other plots to take people out. Can't kill anyone and hide all the bodies? I think that's what I gotta do, Walid. You're definitely right. All right, let's, let's watch this cutscene. Homecoming. Brasov, Romania. Romania. Records, this was a youth correctional facility until 1962, when the estate was overtaken by an obscure Soviet research fund, the Institute for Human Betterment. Looks deserted. The place was abandoned after a fire in 89. Then, only a few weeks ago, it was acquired by an anonymous investor using cryptocurrency. Ooh. It has to be Lucas Gray. He's here. Be careful, 47. The breadcrumbs are almost too easy to follow. It could be a trap. Not a trap. An invitation. Oh. Seven. And even now, you don't remember. This place. This was our prison, where Father trained us, shaped us into killers for Providence. Now, you don't remember. They ripped it out of you, wiped it away, but I do. I remember everything. Oh. Oh, it's Baby 47. His real name was probably Craig or something. You're a terrorist with nothing to lose. You'd say anything. I know it's difficult. You never miss your mark or question your function, but we made a pact. You and I. Do this. And we both lose. There was an incident. That boy, he died. He lived. Because of you. Don't you remember his name? You know this. Deep down, you know. What was his name? Subject 6. Your name is Subject 6. And what is our purpose? To take them all down. That was pretty sick. That was a pretty sick cutscene.
Continue story. In another life. Do 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 do. What are the challenges here? Okay, so this is completely. Is it a different? Oh. It's not a different mission. This is this is the. Oh, interesting. The classics, man. The classics. Yeah, quite. Yeah. Um, that's pretty cool cutscene. What's next up? Oh, exit to menu. Okay, let's do that. All right, so. That was weird, but it's pretty cool. I mean, the cutscenes are, are different because... How do I put this? There, There's no... Legacy pack. What is this? Oh. Target arrives in 87 hours? I think they just emailed me something to do with this. Hold up. Oh, Tuesday, November 20th through December 4th. Oh, interesting. Oh, you only have... Oh, that's cool. So, when he arrives, you only have one chance to take him out, which is pretty cool. And there's, like, ghost mode, which we haven't really typed on. Sniper, assassin. There's, uh, there's a lot of pretty cool stuff. And then if we go... So, the next thing that we have in campaign... Is actually going to be another life. Let, let's watch long shot though. Let's watch long shot. We were going to tear it all down. The Institute, Providence, everyone who'd ever hurt us. We failed. The partners grew paranoid, made sure that Ortmeier's children would never challenge them again. I'm the only one who got away unchanged. The only one left who remembers. Ortmeier was Providence. Everything he did to us, everything he made us do, it all leads back to them. I'm breaking more rules than I care to count, Mr. Gray. What's your play? The partners hide behind a cloak of anonymity. Only one man knows their true identities. Your client, the top controller, the one they call the Constant. He is the key. <laughs> but he is untraceable. So what am I missing? A man would come to the Institute. A man with a Providence pin. The first Constant. If we find him, if he's still alive, he's our way in. You don't know who he is, but 47 does. That's what this reunion is all about. Oh. Show them. You're just going to hand it over. Our one bargaining chip. Olivia. Fine. 47's memory was erased, irreversibly at the time. But after Ortmeier's death, his estate was acquired by the Ether Corporation. And they made an antidote. Ooh. It's a long shot, I know. This is not how it works. We don't just join the revolution. ICA is neutral. We don't take sides. I hate to break it to you, lady, but neutrality is a side. It's the side of the status quo. People have died. Civilians. You align yourself with terrorists, murderers. Sometimes even monsters serve a purpose. Look. Enough. You have a choice. But I made mine a long time ago. I will finish what I started. Oh, is he gonna take it? Oh, hook him up. Oh, this is... This is getting spicy. He looks like James Bond, or Dr. Evil's kid. Most gifted of all my boys. So you're the pick of the litter. Tell me about the incident. The subject ran away. He and another boy. The instigator was punished accordingly. As were all the neighbors. My men did what needed to be done. Thank <laughs> you. 
It won't happen again. Bring your house in order, Doctor. You won't like the alternative. Oh, he remembers the 21st night of September. I remember who he is. Oh, he remembers the 21st night of September. And that's why we're headed to where are we going? We're going to. We're going to Whittleton Creek. I believe that's in the U.S. of A. America. Um, so that's where we're going to head next episode of Hitman 2. And then I think we got one more episode after that. And then we're, we're done with the campaign. Yeah. Yeah. After that, we're done with the campaign. Yeah. It's Wilton Creek, U.S. A. U.S. Oh, and then there's Austria. I think that's for, that's for like some... That's like for the, what is the game mode? The sniper assassin. And there's ghost mode. What is ghost mode? I just want a general consensus. What ghost mode is. Oh, great. Yeah. Just give me the firewall blockage. We're going to put it some Fortnite up real quick. Give me a second here, chat. In another life, I would be Miku. Uh, eliminate targets again. Points and beer. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. It's like a co-op mode, and the sniper assassins like some weird. I don't know. Sniper assassins like snipe people with someone else. The last yard bird. Anyway, oh, you gotta kill. You gotta snipe three people out. Eliminate as many bar bodyguards as possible. Alright, maybe we'll do that for one of the missions. Maybe that'll be its own stream. So, if you watched and enjoyed this, ladies and gentlefish, make sure you smack that like button, especially if you want to see more Hatman sooner than later. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. Most importantly, right now is the best time to go get yourself some fire merch. Head over to typical.store, link in the description below. Get yourself something nice. When you get it, send me a picture on Twitter. I want to show some love back to those of you who support me and support the awesomeness that is typical.store. I guarantee you will not be disappointed with what you get because it is super high quality and super nice stuff, all right? That's why we got like a... We got an awesome return policy if you were if, the, if that's your cup it, you won't need to but uh, that's what it is also the, i think it's like um let me see real quick what we'll, we'll see i think it's 50, 75 bucks or more and you get free shipping if you're in the u.s so typical that store link in the description below go check it out um and then we also have some super chats here that i want to read catch up on uh purge freddy thanks for the the dono so, with a dollar says love your vid shout out to you purge freddy glad you enjoy man Big up, Steve, brother. Uh, and then we also got uh, Chowku with the one, Grim287, Kiron Jones, uh, Akshay. Hope all is well. The smoke's terrible here. I'm sorry to hear that, Akshay. Dude, all the best, brother. Hopefully uh, the fires aren't coming that close to your, your residence. I wish you all the best, man. Uh, we also have Chowku again with a couple of uh, twos. Good coffee or Starbucks coffee? You mean Smurf Oompa Loompa? Uh, it's just like this, this one that I get from the grocery store. It's like a cold brew. It tastes pretty good. It doesn't make me feel like wired or weird when I drink it. Some coffee is a bit too strong for me. So I like it. I wouldn't say it's like, you know, like freaking premium roasted beans or something, but it's pretty good. Uh, Marjana Decoli, shout out to you. The West Dragon with the 50. I've been here for four and a half years and I still love the content you produce. I love you and Samara and all the crazy games you both played over the years. And I hope you continue to do so. Best wishes from your most loyal dragon. Shout out to you, the West Dragon. <laughs> Let's get some dragons in chat, man. If we have any dragon emotes, put them in chat. Thank you, the West Dragon. And shout out to you for the very kind words, my friend. Glad you've been enjoying the content. I will do my best to keep producing content that you enjoy. That goes for every one of you in chat as well. Destiny Hicks tells somebody I said hi and love the both of you. Destiny, you are so kind. Big shout out to you and thank you for the kind words. I'll let Samara know that you said hi. Chauku with the 15. Nothing fancy going on in Chaukulandia. Busiest season at work, nine to 10 hour days, six days a week. So I'll be in and out through the rest of the year, but fret not, I'll always come home. 
How have you been? I've been doing really good. It's good to hear that you're 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 doing well. You're busy, but you're doing well. So I'm happy about that. It's good. It's good whenever you get a chance to pop and chat. Love talking to you, dude. So big shout out to you, and um, thank you for that. I'm doing great, and uh, I'm just super busy. There's so many games coming out, and I want to play them all. I want to play Red Dead like 24/7, but then there's like Hitman, there's Ark, there's the new Walking Dead game, there's Fallout that's coming out that that's come out that I want to play. There's like. And I don't want anybody to go, TG, you're banning this series or you don't do that series. Like, I want to do them all. So it, it's been a bit crazy, but it's games. So I'm enjoying it through and throughout. Uh, shout out to you, brother. And then we have uh, Jawfish with the 10. Love your vids, especially your arc series. And this $10 is a tip for them. When is the next arc stream? Shout out to you. That's very generous of you. And it will be soon. We did the last one yesterday. Make sure to check that out if you haven't already. And the next one will be soon. No exact date, though. Carlos Bernal, thanks for joining. And welcome, Lee. Enjoy those emotes. And if you want to join as well, link will be in the description below. Uh, shout out to um, Officer Bacon with the 9 and the 9. Both the New Zealand Kiwi Bucks. Hitman game is awesome. Watch a few of the Hitman streams. I think I might get it, but I'm hyped for RDR2 online. TG Elite took over GTA 5. Since I joined TG Elite six or seven years ago before you started doing GTA info vids, still remember the Twitch open lobbies. OG TG Elite. That is right, Bacon. You remember. You are you are an OG for sure, man. Big shout out to you, and I can't wait for Red Dead Redemption 2 online. Can't wait to play with you, Shawnee, and everybody else online. It's going to be a great time. Uh, Chaku with the two. You are super white. Welcome to the club. That's what it is, man. White as snow. Shout out to you, brother. And then uh, with the five, Chaku says, Mark had breakfast and didn't share. Just saying kind of me and the public should know. Mark. Mark, we got to talk. What did you have for breakfast, Mark? You got to let us know, man. Because now you're making me hungry. And then we have Destiny Hicks. Chaku's bullying Mark just saying. <laughs> You guys make the funniest super chat conversations. I love you all. It's been real. This stream has been awesome, and I really appreciate you, you all. Again, if you enjoyed it, hit the like button, subscribe. Typical dot store. Don't forget, go get yourself some fire merch, and I'll see you guys in the next stream very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day, and peace out.